and welcome to this video log with me Wayne from swimmingcyclingrunning.com well I've been to Club de Santa I'm nice and brown you can see that um, and it was actually a gift uh, for my birthday from a couple of good friends um, they paid for the accommodation and that was really nice of them and it was a chance to go to Club de Santa that I've heard of for years and years and years and I know triathletes who've been there um, it's effectively a setup that caters for people who want to do athletics, triathlon, swimming, running, anything like that whilst they're on holiday. They have phenomenal facilities there and what I'm going to do is I'm going to describe the facilities, go through the facilities and then we'll come back and we'll discuss it a little bit more. So I'm going to go to the computer and then we'll talk to you later. So this is the bike centre at Club La Santa. You can't see inside here, but it's a huge area with as many bikes as you'll need. They even have bikes that you can buy there. Um, generally, they're individuals' bikes that they've left. And you can see it's just on a ramp up, so it's easy to get your bikes in and out. Uh, those two people, I assume, have just finished a ride. We've got two people just about coming in. One has a road bike and the other has a mountain bike. Both are carrying helmets. They're all available inside, so you don't even have to bring your helmet. Um, and you borrow one of those, you get the bike. In terms of shoes, they've got that, that when you're inside, they'll ask you what kind of shoe you want, so there's no problem having any kind of shoe, they'll just fit new pedals on for you. There you go. So, here we are heading into the swimming pools. Uh, well, this is the 250 meter swimming pools um, that they have at the top end, they also have one 50 meter swimming pool at the bottom end. And you can see how busy this is. It's really never a problem to try and get a lane swimming. I think, to some extent, it's a bit of a mistake having two 50-metre pools next to each other. I think they could do better um, if they actually had one set up as one 25-metre pool and one pool that uh, was triathlon-specific. I'll show you what I mean. So if, if they divided this off, as a, 50, as a 25 meter pool, so you could coach across the pool in 25 meter uh, bits. You could then put a boy there, a boy there, a boy there, and a boy there. Um, and you'd be able to swim one way or another round those boys, triathlon specific. And they have a lot of triathletes here. Every hour or so, or half an hour, change the direction and go the other way and suddenly you're getting huge amounts of practice and if you look at this that's that is a 25 by 25 pool so effectively you've got nearly 100 meters of swimming all around there that you could potentially get in so i think that they could do and you notice up there and when i get there up there um although it moved there are pace clocks and they've got four of those pace clocks good thing about those they're all damn well matched so wherever you start, wherever you look, as soon as you look up, you can look at a pace clock and see the speed you're going, which for a coach and a competitive swimmer or triathlete, that's very important. Beautiful facility, as I say, I think could be used slightly better. Directly next to the swimming pools at the top end is this running track. And you can see there's lots of things here that you can use. Um, for example, you can use the throwing uh, cages that they've got here, throwing and hitting cages. Here um, they've got some bars where you can do chin-ups, you can do exercises there. Um, you can see the, the uh, throwing circles uh, and things like that. So they've got everything that they need uh, for you to practice any sport you like. You can see in the middle is all grass and that's good for football. Here is a boxing ring and they actually do set up boxing classes behind um, here and here you've got tennis courts and paddle tennis courts. So it's literally got everything. This track is well sprung, so running on it is actually quite a joy. I did a couple of sessions on this whilst I was here. Uh, now if we look at this building here, that's where you do all your bookings in the morning. Now not everything needs a booking, such as morning runs at 8.15, uh, which are 3, 5 and 4K. Um, at different speeds you can just turn up to but some things you do need to book where there are limited spaces for use of the equipment um, so that's where you do all that you can also hire your rackets there um, the track itself is perfect for any coach to come along and do technical or track sessions and that is effectively what I used it for but you can see 
All the facilities around there are absolutely beautiful and really well kept. Okay, so let's quickly show you the other side, tennis court. We'll just wind forward as we go through. Oh, another tennis court, you can see. And we're coming up there. That's the boxing ring, which has a cover on it. And that cover obviously goes up and down. I'll go forward a bit more, tennis court. There you go, the boxing ring. And behind the boxing ring are the paddle tennis courts, which you see here. Great game. I've never played it before, but I had instruction, went through a class, booked in, and you can see you can hit it off the backboard if you want. So there you go. That's the other side of the track. OK, so here we are looking at the lagoon, and you can see there's a boy there. There's also one back here. I think that probably that run between there and there probably is in the region of about... 250 meters uh, or 200 thereabouts in, in total but there are other boys as well and there's actually a course that you can swim if you want to um, swim I would imagine it's something like 1500 meters now these two boys here I think are quite useful um, as a coach I think short distances to go around are far better than long distances but some people just want to do their 1500 meter swim and that's okay because you'll see that you can get that in here and the 1500 meter course would be coming along going around a boy which is you know, too perfectly frank just over there um, but that doesn't matter and then back again so you can do that if you actually want to we were staying um, in an apartment literally i'll just bring that on a little bit just here um, so that's where we were in 503 and the view is absolutely beautiful, right over the lagoon. Um, and you could watch the sun go down and have sundowners on the balcony. Tremendous stuff, absolutely lovely. And here is the actual view we had from our room. And you can see we're overlooking the lagoon, absolutely beautiful, uh, perfect situation. Um, and you can see the, the whole lagoon all the way over. It's, it's say that out here somewhere is that second boy. Um, I'm not sure you can see it. Uh, totally out there. Oh, that probably is it over there. That's about 1500 metres away. Okay, so there you have it. What a great facility. And it is a super facility. Everything about it. Three 50 metre pools, can you imagine? Just tremendous. I think they should have used one as a 25 metre pool and at the end had a 25 by 25 section of sighting elements for triathletes because triathletes make up a big part of what they do and that would have been quite good at one end to have sort of four boys that you could swim around one way then the other and that would have been good to me the bike section well I, I don't know any other facility that would necessarily have so many bikes so many different kinds of bikes and tech them up quite so well I am going to club play artists in next week with my swimming club um, and we're doing a camp out there, so I will be reporting back on the differences between the two. Um, we'll see what they are. But if I were you and you look, were looking for a holiday that was in the heat, that had all the facilities so you didn't have to take your bike or anything else, then this certainly hits the button 100%. There's very little that you would want, if anything, that they don't have or couldn't provide. Okay, enjoy your training, enjoy your racing, eat well, see you soon.